Today I would like to introduce our Vermeer Verifier G3 Plus Utility Locator. The Verified G3 Plus Locator is used to pinpoint existing utilities with conductive pipes, cables, or tracer wires, and provide a location and estimated depth. Although the G3 Plus Locator will provide you a depth estimation, it does not remove the responsibility for verifying and exposing all utilities prior to excavation or trenchless product installation. Be sure to call 811 before digging. Before using your utility locator, make sure to read and understand your operator's manual. The G3 Plus locator was built and designed with durability and productivity in mind. Features specific to the G3 Plus locator are ambient noise detection, current direction, wireless control of the transmitter, and the mobile app for utility mapping. Now let's jump into the unit and discuss the features. Components you will need on your job site are receiver, transmitter, ground stake, direct connect cables, and the operator's manual. A feature on the G3 Plus is ambient noise detection. This measures the ambient noise and gives the operator the frequency with minimal interference. This is ideal in congested areas where interference may occur. Simply power on the receiver with the transmitter off, select a frequency, then press and hold the log button. A countdown will then start. Once complete, it will show a ratio of interference on a given frequency. This will be between 99.9% .9 and 0.1%, with the lowest number being the least amount of interference. Do this for multiple frequencies to determine which frequency is best for your job site. Once the location of the utility is determined, insert the ground stake at a 90 degree angle away from the direction of the utility's path, making sure not to cross any other utilities when making this 90 degree connection. Using the direct connect cables, plug the connector into the transmitter. Connect the red clip to the target lines, pipe, cable, or tracer wire, and the black clip to the ground stake. Now power on the transmitter. You should hear a rapid beeping sound. This indicates that you have created a complete circuit. If not, reposition your ground stake further into the earth or in a different location. Once a good circuit has been established, with the direct connect cables properly installed, verify the selected frequency matches the transmitter. Two common locate modes are peak and null. Peak is ideal for precise locating utilities prior to potholing. Null is ideal when locating adjacent to the bore path and you do not need a depth estimation. For this utility, peak mode will be used to locate. When locating, you have to sweep 180 degrees or 360 degrees around your target line, stopping to press gain when prompted to do so. This helps hone the receiver's sensitivity and pinpoint your target line by filtering out any adjacent utilities, which could be picking up signal from bleed off. Once a sweep has been completed, only the target line should be visible to the receiver. It is important to sweep and not swing the receiver for precise readings, watching for the highest point of signal strength. At the point of highest signal strength, place the blade on the ground in a vertical position, making sure not to match any unlevel topography and press the depth button for an estimation. One way to confirm the locate is to raise the receiver a confirmed distance above the ground and take another depth reading. Another method is triangulation, which compares the left and right distance from the target line to zero signal strength. These distances should be approximately equal to the target line. An additional method is to verify that you have a steady signal strength above the target line. To help confirm your target line's identity, another feature on the G3 Plus is current direction. This shows how the current is flowing on the utility. If current is flowing back towards the transmitter, that is an indication of bleed off. Mark the depth and location on the ground and proceed along the path of the utility, taking depth estimations as desired to locate the utilities. Now that the utility's location and depth estimations have been completed, 
locate any additional utilities prior to excavation. With productivity in mind, another new feature on the G3 Plus is the ability to control the transmitter's power output and change the frequencies from up to 500 feet away. This minimizes unnecessary time walking back and forth to the transmitter, keeping you focused and productive. Last but certainly not least, we introduced our G3 Plus Map mobile app. This app will be used to log pertinent utility information such as date, time, job name, operator name, device name, frequency, depth estimation, current index measurement, utility type, and geospatial data. This information can be shared via text or email and then uploaded into a GIS platform. For more locating methods and techniques, please reference the operator's manual or reach out to your local Vermeer dealer specialist.